Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are headed into the Walgreens to check out some awesome deals that you can do this week. We got amazing deals happening and I'm so excited to share the deals with you. So without further ado, let's jump straight into the store and check out the deals. So the first deal I'm going to do this week is on the Garnier Fructis and Garnier Whole Blends. They are two for eight dollars and when you buy two you're going to be get back a three dollar registry reward. Now do keep in mind these are on the same promotion. So um, you have to do them in separate transactions if you want to get whole blends and fructis. So they're two for eight. There are three on two printable coupons for the whole blends and the fructis on coupons.com. And then there's also digital coupons, shop me and rebates. So once again, two for eight minus three dollars, you'll pay five dollars. Then you're going to get back the three dollar registry reward, making two of them only two dollars. Head and shoulders, buy two, get a $4 register reward, pick up two for $12, use the three off two digital, you'll pay nine, get back four, making two of them only $5 or two fifty dollars each. Alright, here's a deal on the L'Oreal L5, they are two for $9, there's a $3 off two store coupon making them two for six, and you can stack it with a manufacturer's $3 on two printable, or there's a digital coupon, dropping your final cost down to $2, no, $3 for two of them. Okay, the next deal is going to be on Colgate products. This week, they are $4.50. Once again, buy two, get a $3 registry reward. Almost the same deal as last week, but this week, they gave us two fifty digitals. One for the toothpaste and one for either the toothbrush right here or coming down here, the mouthwash. So the total for the toothpaste and the toothbrush brings you to $9. After your $5 in digitals, you'll pay $4, get back $3 registry reward, making to only a dollar. Okay, next up here's a deal on the Crest um, Mini Mouthwashes. This is the 8.4 ounce. They are $3 this week, so buy two, it'll bring you to $6. Clip the three off two digital. Wow. So um, you will be paying $3 for two of these, and then they're buy two, get a $3 registry reward. Dropping the final cost down to free for both. Okay, there's a separate digital coupon for the Crest and Oral B um, toothpaste and toothbrush for three dollars. So same thing, buy two for six. Use a three on two digital. You're gonna end up paying three dollars. Then you're gonna get a three dollar registry reward, making two of them free. And do keep in mind to do separate transactions to get both your registry reward. Be sure to check your stores, everybody, for these awesome clearance tags on deodorant. Deodorant spray, razors, everything you can think of down that aisle. Okay, here's a great deal on the cotton now toilet paper. They are $4.99. And I have a $2 digital coupon, so I'm going to drop it down to um, $2.99 for this 4 equals 16, which is a great deal. Also, if you like the Walgreens brand toilet paper, they are $1.99 on sale this week, so that is also a pretty good deal. Okay, next up, we have some deals on some laundry products. So there are some gain products that are 4 for $16. I'll show you some digitals for those in a minute. But there's another laundry deal going on for PNG, um, four for ten dollars for Bounce Downy, Tide Simply, um, the Downy Unstoppables, and the Mini uh, Fabric Softener. So you'll just pay ten dollars, and there is digital coupons on some of them, so you could get them as low as like four for eight fifty, which is a pretty good deal. So stock up if you need it. And you can use Walgreens Cash and Registry Awards to lower your out-of-pocket costs. Okay, here's a deal I'll be passing on this week, but I'll be holding off because I want to wait till there's a registry award. The Bounty Essentials is five forty nine, and there's a three dollar digital Walgreens gave us, dropping it down to two forty nine. Okay, so I have a two dollar off one digital. It works on the Gain Liquid or the flings up there. I'm gonna grab the. No, actually, I'm gonna grab the flings. I'm gonna grab two of the flings. So. I have a $2 on one digital and a $1.50 on one digital. So I'm going to grab two packages of these. And then I'm going to pick up one of these dryer sheets. I have a $1.50 digital. I think I'll actually grab two of those. And then I have a dollar digital for the second one. So 
The total for all of these um, gain products is $16. After my $2, my $1.50, $1.50, and dollar, that is two, three fifty, five, six dollars in digitals. I'll pay only ten dollars for all four or two fifty each, which is an awesome deal. Okay, when I did the deals yesterday for the last deals um that you could do last week, I got three spend boosters, a spend twenty get ten, a spend twenty five get seven, a spend forty get nine, and I found a spend twenty five earn seven on the ground. So I'm definitely utilizing all these. I'm gonna be showing you each transaction I'll be doing with each spend booster. Okay, so here is how I'm gonna be utilizing the spend twenty earn ten dollars in Walgreens cash paper booster that I have. So I will be using the contactless payment method on this deal. So it's actually really easy. All you do is like you go to your wallet and then you click on barcode or something like that. And then it's like, how much Walgreens cash do you want to use? And then you enter an amount and then you just have them scan the barcode and it's already paid for. It's like really, really simple. So this is how I'm going to be doing it. The total for all of these items right here will bring me to $27.99. And then I'll be rolling $5 in Walgreens cash. I'll still be at $22.99, um, which is over $20 for this spend booster to still give me back the Walgreens cash. So I'll still be over that. I'm also going to throw in a $3 registry reward from last week. Wow, that was a voice crack. Um, and then I have a $3 digital, a $2.50 digital, a $2.50 digital, a $2 digital, and a $3 digital. So I'll pay $7.99 at the register. And then I'll be getting back a total of $9 in registry rewards, $3 for this, $3 for these, and then $3 for um, these. And then I'll be getting back $10 in, in, in points. Department. So it's going to be an awesome deal. Um, so that is how I'm going to do that transaction. And then I'll calculate the other ones and show you what I'm doing. For them. Okay, here is how I'm utilizing the spend 25 earn 7 in Walgreens cash. So this one right here, the total for all of these items, I'm grabbing one of these for $1.99. The Oral-B dill, the Garnier dill, and then the Colgate dill. It'll be $25.49. I'll roll $9 in registry rewards from the first transaction that I do. And then I have the 250 digital, a 250 digital, a three digital, and a three digital. So out of pocket, I'll pay $5.49 plus taxes, get back seven in Walgreens cash, and once again, nine more dollars in registry rewards that I will be rolling in my next transaction and that I'll be showing that to you. Okay, here's my third transaction of how I'm doing my other spend 25 earn seven in Walgreens cash. So, um, I will be doing the Colgate deal and then I'll be doing the gain deal. Um, that will bring me to $25 exactly. And then I will be using the two 250 digitals, the $2 digital, or for this, the $1.50 digital, $1.50 digital and dollar digital. So at the register, oh, and then I'll roll nine dollars in registry awards once again from here. So at the register, I'm going to be paying a total of five dollars plus taxes, and then I'll be getting back seven dollars in points for this and a three dollar registry reward for this. Then I'll be rolling that registry reward into getting these, and just keep rolling the same registry reward. Um, and then let me figure out my last transaction for the spend for the get nine. So I'll be back. Okay, so here is a great deal that I found on the CoverGirl. CoverGirl is buy one kit one 50% off. Um, I don't think there's any promotion other than that. So that's the only promotion. I'm going to be going for these four kit eyeshadows. What is that? I don't really know. It's an eye product. I know that. So I'm going to be grabbing four of these. That's going to bring me to $17.96. Is that $17.96? One? No. Twenty-one ninety-six. Oh, sorry, I had to do the math. I'm twenty ninety-six for all four of these. I hope my mom likes this color. I don't really know what she likes. I don't pay attention to that. So twenty ninety-six. I'm gonna use two two-dollar printable coupons from coupons.com. Then I have a two-dollar digital. So at the register, I'm gonna be paying fourteen ninety-six. And then I'll be getting back a total of $12 on Ibotta. There are $3 rebates that attach to these. Um, I'm kind of mad, though, because there is these. And obviously, this excludes the Ibotta rebate. Um, same with, like, all these other eye products. 
that are on Clarence. I skin all of them. They're the only ones that are not attaching to the iBothery bait, obviously. But I'm going to pick up these, and then I'm going to submit to Shop Man for $2 back. Drop on the final cost for all four of these down to only $0.96 cents or $0.24 cents a piece, and I can live with that. That's awesome. I'm also going to be picking up two of these Ziploc baggies. So these are two for $8, and the iBother rebate says it's going um, away in one day. So just keep that in mind. But they're two for eight, and there's two fifty back on Ibotta with a limit of three. So I'm picking up two, so I'm getting back $5. Dropping the final cost down to $3 or $1.50. Okay, this still did not work out for me, but if your store will push through coupons for you, these travel size gold bond lotions are $1.79 and these $1.50 coupons to have any specification, so you could grab them for $0.29 cents a piece. All right, y'all, let's go over these transactions from the Walgreens. Oh, yeah. oh. All right, everybody, let's go over these transactions from the Walgreens. So I did a whole lot of transactions as you can see. So we're going to go one by one, but we're going to go quick. So here is the first one. And this was utilizing the spend 20, earn $10 in Walgreens cash. So there are the Garnier Whole Blends, the Oral-B, the Colgate, and the Cottonelle. So there is my point coupon purchase. And then there are all my digital coupons. Every digital coupon came off, which I'm so happy about. So as you can see, the subtotal was $14.99. I did roll $5 in Walgreens cash to pay $12.02 out of pocket. And then on this transaction, um, is that anything back else than that? No. So I think it was $12.02. And then I did get back a total of $10 in Walgreens cash for this transaction. I used a contactless payment method. And I don't know, it worked on this transaction, but it didn't work on my other one. And I swear I did my math right, but I don't know. So um, I'll share that with you in a minute. But this transaction was a success. So my next transaction, um, I was utilizing the spend 25 earn $7. So there's the Oral-B, the Vertice the toilet paper the colgate and then i did i calculated the wrong i was like a dollar short no not a dollar short a penny short so i added two lindor chocolates they're like two for a buck the little mini ones um so here are the three registry words i used from the first transaction let me show you those the one from the Garnier printed, the one for the png printed and the one for the colgate deal printed they all printed which is awesome Okay, so I rolled um, those points, as you can see right there, not the points, the registry awards, wow. So I ended up paying seven, wow, voice crack, um, paid 783 out of my own pocket. And then on this transaction, um, I got back the $7 in Walgreens cash. Now I was using three different accounts, my account, my mom's account, and my brother's account. So this was, I think I did this one on my mom's account. Um, so that was great. Okay, my next transaction. I was using the second spend 25 earn 7 that I found on the ground. So there's the Colgate up there. And then the gain. There are the three registry awards that I rolled once again. I just kept rolling them. They are rolling. The Colgate deals um, rolling. The Crest deals rolling and the Garnier deals rolling. There are all the digital coupons. They all came off once again. There is um how much I paid with tax, which was six dollars and eighty one cents. And then I did get back a total of seven dollars in Walgreens cash for this transaction. So that was a success. Um, very great deal in the game. I'm so happy I did that. And then I did get back the three dollar registry award for that. Okay. Okay, and then I wanted to see if I could get another, like, little spend booster to see if I didn't have to do the big $40 transaction. Um, so I just bought two Lindor chocolates, two for a buck. Um, and then I got the same spend for the or nine. So I was like, eh, whatever. So I paid a dollar three for that. Nothing crazy to show. Um, okay, and then after that... 
I was using some Walgreens cash from my from my brother's account and then my mom's account. So I could um, pay nothing out of pocket and then get back a register reward. So out of pocket, I paid 44 cents. It got back a $3 register reward. This one right here. And then um, I picked up the whole blends. And I used, that's a $3 paper coupon. Um, rolled $5 Walgreens cash, paid 58 cents. Got back another $3 register reward. Then I did the Garnier for Tees, $4 each, rolled a $3 coupon, rolled $5 in points, paid $0.58 cents out of the pocket. So, I, yeah, on this one I have $3 Walgreens cash left over. I'm wiped, out, I'm wiped out of Walgreens cash on my brother's account. I only have like $8. So I use that quick, but it's okay. Okay, and then here's the big spend for the get $9 Walgreens cash transaction. There is the cover girl, the Fructis, the Colgate, the Crest, and the Ziploc. There's my point coupon purchase, okay? There's my two cover girl coupons. The gold bond, I had to take those off because they obviously did not go through. Even though the coupon has no specification, it did not go through. So I was like, let's take it off. And then all the registry rewards rejected like always. So I was like, can we cancel? And she's like, sure. So then we canceled it and rang everything up except for the gold bond. Um, everything still worked out in the end. There are my paper coupons, as you can see right there. So I paid $25.96 out of pocket. Well, $19.73 after I rolled Walgreens cash and adding tax. And then I did not get back any Walgreens cash on this transaction. And I was like, how could that be? Because my subtotal was fifty one ninety six, and after rolling the ten dollars in points it'd be forty one ninety six, and that's about forty dollars to get back that nine dollars so i was like what the heck so i was like that's really weird so luckily my store is awesome and they did end up giving me the nine dollars in walgreens cash as you can see they gave me seven and two so i was really really happy with that Okay, and then on this transaction, I did get back the $3 registry reward for the Fructis, $3 registry reward for the Colgate, $3 registry reward for the Crest. And then I did submit to Ibotta for a total of $17 back, $5 for the Ziploc, $12 for the CoverGirl. And then I submitted the Shop Meum for $2 back on the CoverGirl, and then $2.50 back on the one Colgate and $2.50 back on the other Colgate that I did not use a coupon for. So that was awesome, Chem. And then there's those registry rewards. These are the ones that I got from this transaction. So yeah, that's why I just keep showing them because they're the same thing. And then my last transaction was super easy. I just picked up two more whole blends, used a $3 coupon, um, rolled $5 in points, paid 58 cents. And then I have $9 left in Walgreens cash on this transaction. But I am ending with $12 in registry rewards that I have the roll next week, which is amazing. And then um, I did have some other things print. So I had a 20% off print. Another 20% off print. Another 20% off print. Another 20% off the print. I spent 40 get $9 in Walgreens cash. That was the one I was telling you about when I bought the chocolate. And then, here is a Catalina promo going on. So, it's on Move Free, Digestive Advantage, or Mega Red. When you buy one, you'll get $5. Or when you buy two, you'll get back $10. It says a coupon to offer your next shopping order. So, hey, if you need these... Um, I think there's some coupons for them, so this may be good. And it's valid until 12-12. Oh, between 11-15. So it actually does not start, what's today, the 12th. You'll be seeing this on the 13th. So this won't start till Wednesday, I believe. So if you want to work out a scenario for that, you might come out good. Um, but yeah, guys, that's all I got for this video. I do want to point out when I also did do the contactless payment method, 
when I went to go um, scan the barcode, the cashier scanned the barcode, and it took off the Walgreens cash, but it didn't pay for it like it automatically did last time. So I had to, like, insert my card, like how I was doing the regular payment, because last time, what happened was the cashier scanned the barcode, and then it just said, oh, you rolled this many points, and this went on your card. So I was like, hmm, okay, weird. So I don't know if that had anything to do with it, but I'm not sure. Anyways, I know I have not been here um, for like a week and a half. And honestly, I've been just kind of lazy and didn't want to do a video if I'm doing being honest. But I'm back and I'm going to hit it hard. Okay, so I'm okay. Um, everything's good. All good. So I do hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure to give me a thumbs up. And smash the subscribe button down below. It would really help me out. We are almost at 2,000 subscribers. When we do hit 2,000, I'll be doing a giveaway. So stay tuned for that. And be tuned. Stay tuned for um, giveaways coming up in the future. Surprise giveaways you just never know. Um, anyways, I hope you guys have a great week. And any questions or comments or concerns, drop them in the comment box down below. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.